Hi, I've run into the same problem that many of you have run into, and that is importing an ABI container file into Sony Vegas. Uh, sometimes you don't know what the codec is, sometimes you do. A lot of the tutorials on YouTube have you downloading codecs and installing other codecs, having you convert files that need other codecs. Nothing for me worked directly, but I did uh, find a workaround by experimenting with my own software. So here's what uh, an ABI looks like when you try to bring it in to Vegas, and you notice that it didn't go into the video track, it just went into the voice track. So what I did from there is I went to the internet and went to handbrake.fr and downloaded the handbrake open source ripper and encoder. Once I did that, then I opened it. Correct. And I go to source, choose video file, pick the video file that uh, you're using. In this case, it's a job. Okay, you'll notice that it's grayed out and then it populates, it has to read the file. In this case, I chose the normal preset. I leave everything default. The next thing that I do is go up here to browse uh, so that I can name and locate uh, the file. In this case, uh, I'll leave it as inside job one, save, Click start. And that starts the encoding process. I'll come back to you in a few minutes. That looks like it's going really fast. Anyways, so, so we'll take a pause there. Well, you can see that the encoding is finished as it says down here. So we can close handbrake at this point. And I've already put the, uh, the handbrake encoded video in the project media bin. Um, you can also go to Explorer to import it. Anyways, as we recall, here's the original ABI file. Try and put it in, and it doesn't go into the video track, it just goes into the voice track. So let's include that. And here is the same video that I just encoded using handbrake. And there you are. It has the video track and the audio track. And that's all you have to do. Good luck and take care.